Nothing special. Well, there's never anything special. Is there something there? Is there something right there? Ink ribbon. Eh. I don't need an ink ribbon. Cardboard and posters. Nothing useful. Well, I'm sure somebody somewhere got use out of that poster. Giggity! And hello and welcome back to Resident Evil. Once again, this is Nicodemus Kane playing Resident Evil, the PS1 version. Uh, playing it through my PS3, uh, if you needed to know. I, I don't know if you need to know or not, but uh, that's just how I'm doing it. Uh, but uh, welcome back for yet another episode. We are closing on the end of this bad boy, and I am excited as I'll get out. I actually... Uh, I already recorded the last episode, um, just a little bit before this one. I was actually right before I'm... It's now right before I'm going to bed. And I said, you know what, I want to stay up and I want to I want to do this. I want to try to see how far we can get. I think we've only got... <laughs> I think we've only got maybe two more episodes left. Um, and so I am excited. I, I am ready to go. So, uh, we have minimal, <laughs> minimal everything right now because we do not need much... We need to find the uh, places where these MO discs go, and then we need to... What else do we need to do? Uh, yeah, we need to go through the maze, which I am not looking forward to, and then we need to go in those other two rooms. Um, let's go ahead and do the maze. I, uh, I remember this damn maze. Uh, there's some not good guys in this maze. <laughs> let's put it that way. Um, I don't know what they're called. I don't know what the hell they're called. They're like, like some kind of spider. I think they're more like ants than anything else. Some some weird ass thing. They crawl on the ceiling, and I mean they're like liquors, but they're not liquors. Um, yeah, I don't know what the hell they're called. You'll see one. There's one right there. There's one right there too. Oh, you son of a! I was just about ready to say, a power panel. Some areas do not have power. Will you activate the blacked out areas? Yes, I will. And then I will run... Get the... You son of a bitch. I was just about ready to say how easy it is to get through this area. Because you just have to run like hell. But, uh... Of course, Nico's Law is going into effect even before I can even say what the hell. Alright, come on. Hurry up. Holy shit. God damn it. I bet you I'm on danger now, too. And I don't have any health or anything. Fuck. Um... Screw this. I'm gonna kill these assholes. This is fucking stupid. Um, what's this? It's a passcode output machine. Yes, if I had an MO disk, I could get the code. Alright, well, then let's use a disk. Passcode 03. And, th and through your offspring, all nations of Earth will be blessed because you have obeyed me. Genesis 2218. Alright. Passcode 3 has been filed. Alright, good, good, good. Now, there is one more of these assholes in here. There he is. <clears throat> Son of a bitch. God damn. Oh. <clears throat> Holy crap. <laughs> I, man, that sucks so bad. I don't, I don't know how bad I'm doing here. I need to stop. Hopefully there's none in this room. I'm on caution. Okay, so I have to be careful. Let's combine that so I don't have to worry about that. Um... God, what is in this room? What's all this shit? Nothing, nothing, nothing. It's just... It's a triggering system activator. It's quite big. Okay. Sure, it's quite big. Where's the... Oh, there it is. Power connection switch. The elevator power is off. Will you connect it? Yes. Power for the elevator is acted, activated as the power supply and the circuit has been connected. All right. Good. Okay. So that takes care of the elevator. Um, there's an elevator at the end, of the, the end of the hall that we don't have to worry about right this second. But it, well, as long as that is on, I am happy. Are these guys dead? Are they staying dead? I hope they're staying dead. Okay, and then we did get that passcode thing. But these three are not. These three are still alive. So I have to watch out. Uh, the only good thing about this is we don't have to come back through here. Come on, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Get, whoo, 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 whoo. 
Whew, holy crap. That was unbelievable. <laughs> I, I I was just going to say, you know, I if I remember right, that the one time where I kind of played on just to, you know, see where I was going, I, I was able to run through there and they never touched me once. I'll be damned. <laughs> I'll be damned if they didn't get a hit off on me. Holy crap. Okay, um, there's got to be one. Yeah, there's one right there. Just a small one. I don't need, like, a big one. All right. All right. La-dee-da-da. La-dee-da-da. Yeah, I'm, 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 like, anxious. I'm jumping to get out of here. So down that hallway to the right is the elevator. But I don't want to go down there because I may trigger the scene. There's a scene that happens with Barry. Um, at least in the HD version, all I had to do was just walk down there and it triggered. Um, oh, wait. I got a red plants. Okay. Red herb, I'm sorry. We got some shotgun shells. Looks like we got a puzzle. Uh, looks like it's a... Let me get back out of this. Looks like it is a... Yeah, it's a poison puzzle. You can see the grates. So I'm pretty sure that I have to push this over. Uh, probably should not be stepping on that red button just yet. Push this over. Um... Okay, do I have to push this over to that to kind of even it up? Sure, why not? This, uh, since I'm not going to be able to get it over there, I think the way it looks is I have to push it this way. Yeah, see? I have to push it this way so that I could push it down, because where it was over there, you couldn't push it down. Okay, push it down there, and then push it real good. <laughs> down here. Mm-hmm. There we go. And then push it this way. La da 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 da. And then, just for safety's sake, we will push it this way. Is that as far as I can go? All right. Come down here. Oh shit! Come on. Come on. Walk around it. There you go. <clears throat> And there you go. There's an air shaft. Will you enter it? Yes, I will. Oh, boy. It's a morgue. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, what's this? More bullets. Yes, please. Please, please, please. And then... Is there nothing else over here? God. Corpse is laid here. Wonderful. Absolutely terrific. This place seems to be a morgue. You think? It, uh, hopefully none of these assholes will move on me. It's a passcode output machine. If I had an MO disk, I could get the code. Well, you know, I just happen to have a passcode output disk. Passcode 02. I will surely bless you and make your, des make your descendants, holy crap, as numerous as the stars in the sky and as the sand on the seashore, your descendants will take possession of the cities will take possession of the cities of their enemies. Genesis 22, 17. So I wonder if maybe you get, like, all three of them and they will save the full verse. I have to find a third one. I don't even know where that is. Um, yes, I unlocked it. All right. I think this is... Where is this at? God, where are we going to come out at? Oh. Oh, so we came out... Oh, so we came out there, so we covered two... Okay. Alright, now I need to go in that room on the top r top left, and then I need to go down to the prison. <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> I am not taking any more crap from this damn game. I, I am not. Uh, I This game has put me through too much, and I am just over everything that they keep throwing at me. I, I Seriously. It's, it's too much. It's just way too much. Alright, this room right here. Open sesame. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. How many of them are in here? Holy shit. God, am I out of bullets? Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh god, there's another one. Oh Jesus, how many more are there? Are there any more? Oh, hello! <laughs> I 
Dark Sight 1998. Yeah, good, good stuff. Uh, my 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 uh, my 98 wasn't that good. Holy crap! But still, that was a fax. It's a fax. To the general manager of sanitation division from Special Committee on Disasters, Raccoon Special Research Department. This memorandum is strictly confidential and must be destroyed as soon as it is understood. Regarding the T-virus outbreak that occurred recently, this committee conducted a field survey. According to the survey results, estimates on the amount of damage caused by the accident are considerably greater than reported earlier. First, first, although it is very difficult to obtain accurate data in terms of actual numbers, it is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-virus. The body count will most likely increase since nearly all of the survivors show symptoms peculiar to the T-virus. Second, our security system is still in operation. However, our special security guard squad has been nearly destroyed. Uh oh Because of that, research information considered by our company to be top secret has been made available to outsiders. Whoops. Countermeasures should be taken as soon as possible. Finally, many of the subjects from the experiment have escaped and are out of control. We believe that some researchers were killed by these subjects and their bodies were mutilated. Uh, by curious coincidence, I don't believe in coincidences, these events are proof of the success of our research. However, there is also a very high risk that th this news... Oh, is this the first typo that I've found in a game? There is also a very high risk that this news... No, no, that's right. It just sounds weird, though. Very high risk that this news, that this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. I don't, for some reason, that just seems like that should say that these news, but that's not right, though, is it? It's that this news may be leaked. It's it, Again, it's the weird-ass sentence structure that they keep in this game. It just, it messes you up. The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain. However, we hope the problem will be solved quickly. We are especially concerned that the state police and STARS are intervening too quickly. Yeah, no shit. We need to act on this situation as well. Right. Well, you know, I mean, I think we're into it now. I, 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 uh, and I am pretty sure that uh, you guys have, have, uh, you guys have STARS all up in your ass now, don't you? Alright, here's the third one. Get this, use that. Passcode zero 01. I swear by myself, declares the Lord, that because you have done this and have not withheld your son, your only son, Genesis 22, 16. So what does it say? I know. I, I, I have to know, though. I, I do. I have to know. I, I just... Security system, researcher's letter, vigil, passcode. Oh, here we go. Passcode 1. I swear by myself, declares the Lord, that because you have done this and have not withheld your son... Your only son. I will surely bless you and make your descendants as numerous as the stars in the sky and as the sand on the seashore. Your descendants will take possession of the cities of their enemies. And through your offspring, all nations on earth will be blessed because you have obeyed me. I think that is uh, Moses. I think it's who he was talking to. I could be wrong on that. But that sounds like the uh, the Moses verses, uh, after they got off the ark and all that stuff. Most of most of them are fiction books. Excuse me. Nothing special. Well, there's never anything special. There's something there. Is there something right there? Ink ribbon. Eh. I don't need an ink ribbon. Cardboard and posters. Nothing useful. Well, I'm sure somebody somewhere got use out of that poster. Giggity. <laughs> Uh, is there nothing special on this, huh? Really? That was it? Okay. Hey, man. I'll go with that. Why not? <laughs> yeah, my 98 was not that special. Holy shit. Uh, alright. <laughs> passcode panel. You've entered in the passcode. Okay. You've entered in the passcode. You've entered in the passcode. And now it's unlocked. So let's go in. Yeah, 98, I was, uh, I was, whew, um, God, I was living with my dad, trying to find a job, holy shit, 
Jill? Jill? Is that you, Jill? Uh oh. <laughs> oh, Chris, you're alive. Chris, you bastard. Of course. Damn it, we're in quite a predicament, Jill. You think? I know, Chris. Anyway, I have to open this room. Uh, it doesn't work. Well, Chris, I'll be sure to come back and help you soon. Will you wait here? Thanks. I'll be waiting here for you. <laughs> he just he just sounds like he's so overjoyed. He's like, yeah, thanks. Sure, no problem. It's a fucking sauna in here. Or it's a fucking spa in here. I've got everything I ever needed. Jesus Christ. Sauna. Did you hear me? Wow. Again, I will uh I will uh reiterate that I am it, it is it is very close to my bedtime. I'm not going to say it is my bedtime, but it's close enough that I am like, you know, maybe I should think about going to bed. So, that is it, pretty much. I mean, you know, the only thing left is going the elevator. And once you go in the elevator, then that's pretty much the end of the game. Um, and it's probably a good, probably a good 15 minutes. Um, oh god, look at these assholes. Oh, I didn't think they were that close. Oh. Oh, fuck me. I didn't want, I did not want to waste these bullets. I really didn't. I was trying to run around these guys. Oh god. Damn. Fuck. How close was I? Caution. Actually, I was probably close enough that if they would have gotten me one more time, I probably would have died. Dude, come on, man. Always something. There's always something in this damn game, I swear. And that's why I'm like, what the hell? Can we just get over it already? Holy shit. Uh, alright. But yeah, after this, you go, you go take the elevator and then it's endgame. I mean, it's... Yeah, <laughs> you're really pretty much done at that point. So, you know, I, um... Combine those. Combine those. Combine those. I'm actually gonna grab some herbs, too, and combine those while we're talking. But, um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, save it here and stop. I know this one was kind of short, but hey, you know, I mean... It's like I said, we are, uh... We are right there. We are... <laughs> we are almost done. It's 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 weird to say, but it's true. I mean, you know, we're we're uh, we're right there. I I don't know what else to say other than that. Yes, I will mix the herbs for God's sakes. But um, I have been Nicodemus Kane. This has been Resident Evil. I uh, absolutely appreciate you guys coming along for the ride. I think this is. This is the second to last episode, and I think the episode after this is going to be our last episode. So, you know, I mean, definitely you're going to have to come back and check that out. Because the ending of this game, from what I remember, is kind of crazy. I don't think it's like... I don't think it's like over the top. You know, I don't think it's over top to the point that I'm like, oh my god, I can't do it. I think, uh... I think with what I have... Let me check my, uh... See, I got flame rounds, and I've got explosive rounds. Dude, I got this. I got this. There's nothing. There's nothing for me to be scared of. That right there is going to be all I need to take to take on a tyrant. I mean, that's... That's it. That's all I need. I... Well, okay, actually... <laughs> fuck me. Uh... Now I have everything I need to take on a tyrant. Jesus Christ. But yeah, no, that's, that's, uh, that's, that looks good to me. Uh, you know, I, I think, uh, I will stop it here. And then we will pick it up from this point, And then we'll just, I'll just walk right up to the elevator. And we'll go through it. I, I don't remember. I think there's a cutscene. Uh, I think there's a moderately long cutscene. And then, if I remember right, there's a fight with a tyrant. And then... There's a countdown, and I think I have to go and try to rescue Chris within that countdown, I think. I don't... It was very close. Every time I ever played it, it was, like, super close. The countdown, I was almost to the point where I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. I can't believe it's it's that close. But, uh... 
And then, I know in the HD version, you went up to the helipad, and then there was a fight there, and then it was done. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how similar this is to the HD or not. I, Again, I, I played this almost 20 years ago, so, you know, I don't remember. I, I really don't remember. Uh, but, yeah. Yeah, come on back. Come on back next time. It'll be the last episode. And we will have some fun doing it. Uh, other than that, though, again, I've been Nicodemus Kane. Thank you guys very much for watching. I have enjoyed doing it. I hope I hope you guys have enjoyed watching me do this. Um, other than that, I wish you all well on all your future endeavors. And I hope that the world lasts for you. Take care. Take it easy. Stock up on ammo. Keep an ink ribbon in your, in your pocket. And always remember to mix your herbs. <laughs>